Hi, this is Bob with Gibbs RV, and today we're looking at a 2005 Bigfoot 25RQ. These are a two-piece clamshell design travel trailer. You can see there's an upper half and a lower half. Molded very similar to the way a hot tub or a boat is. The bottom top are placed together so you have just the one seam. Also, the molded front end fiberglass piece features uh, storage for your propane tank, battery. It's got a fiberglass rock guard for the front windshield on gas struts. Rubber lockers, much better than metal hardware. This one has an awning across the top. You see it's got the rounded radio entry door, also on a gas shock. Storage compartments, assist handle, chrome wheels. You've got a little bit of rust on the lug nuts there. That's somewhat common. Graphics overall are in pretty good shape. We did a little bit of touch up on uh, the one on the front so it looks good again. Here on the back you can see that same solar tinted on the glass, Continental tire kit, rear bumper. Also serves for sewer tube storage. Uh, down the back side you can see same condition. We do have a storage compartment here. Nice and dry, lockable place to keep your extra camping gear. Also we have outside shower, plug-ins, and the water heater. Now let's take a look at the inside. They have their own style of lock. If you uh, get frustrated with RV locks, much better quality lock on these. We step inside, you've got the front dinette booth here. Of course now this makes into a bed, folds down. We've also got overhead storage. Here's an example of their cabinetry. It's solid oak on spring-loaded shock absorbers forcibly closes and stays closed. Uh, we need to replace the CD player. It's missing the face plate. It does have built-in speakers throughout the coach. Carpeted ceiling, kind of a trademark of luxury RVs. Skylight with the pullable shade. We've got a built-in bureau here right beside the dinette booth. Also storage compartment behind. Window valances. Day-night shades all tie in together with the fabric. Floor plan here you can see we've got the hallway and on one side we have our galley area at a countertop just pull up. We got the stove. It's a three burner style stove with the raised grill, microwave, exhaust fan, built-in lights, more oak cabinets. You'll notice you don't see any uh, staples, glue, Tendon mortars. Roof air conditioning above me here. A mirror on the side wall. Household style door to the bathroom where we have our toilet, sink with lots of drawers, linen storage, vanity, power exhaust fan, and a wet bath. It's one piece shell, so you don't have to worry about any water getting away. Also, above, you'll notice it's got a skylight in there too. It's nice and bright. Drying rack on the inside of the door. And directly across from it here, we have this nice wardrobe closet, cedar lined, with storage drawers underneath. These are the, uh, see they got the locking rails, so they stay shut. Queen size bed, we just put a new mattress in here, didn't have a mattress before, with a night bureau on either side. Overhead storage, reading lights, nice clean roof, no stains, and lots of windows. If you have a favorite view, you can really absorb it all here any time of year in a Bigfoot because they have the insulation to go camping year-round. 2005 Bigfoot right here at Gibbs RV in Coos Bay 1-800-824-4388. This one does, uh, we do need to fix the molding you can see on the window there and that's uh, just about the only flaw you can really find on this um, RV. It's a Gibbs RV 541-888-3424 or see us on the web at www.gibsrv.com. That's G-I-B-S-R-V.com in Coos Bay.